Hey guys, Free the Showdown here, back with another review video for the $1,000 PC build. Uh, not really review, actually an unboxing, kind of messed that up a little bit, but it's all good. Uh, today we are unboxing the AS Rock H97M Pro 4 motherboard. This will be the motherboard that I'm using for my build. Um, if you guys don't know this, this is actually my first PC build, so I don't know a whole lot, but I, I know how to read a box. So. I know that this is Intel compatible for your Intel CPUs and whatnot. You can see here it has um, four slots of DDR3 memory available, or four slots of DDR3 memory available. What does it say here? Six USB 3.0, two front, four rear. Six USB 2.0, four front, two rear. Just oh my goodness, this just this just looks great. Updated audio. Upgraded uh, temperature control, just just looks great. Um, got this um, black and blue theme here. I didn't really try to keep it color efficient or anything like that. Like try to keep everything the same color because I don't have a windows a windowed case, so everything's probably going to be random colors. But that is fine with me. So, uh, um, oh, there is no thing on it. Okay. So this will just open it. Yeah, there's like no evidence of one ever being there. Just letting you know I did not open this. Okay, so here looks like we have a little manual here. Inside, a nice thick manual telling you everything you need to know. Along with your disc here. Here's your, your back uh, metal piece that will go into your case. Great, we're going to need that. Um, wires. Wires to hook it up, I'm guessing. Not, a, not real familiar. Uh, here she is itself. Ooh, that thing is beautiful. Let's see if I can pull this out without breaking it. Can we? Can we do it? Ooh. Here she is, guys. Okay. I'm gonna delicately move this out of the way here. I'll turn it around so you guys can get a good view of the box. So here we are with the. So here we are with the AS Rock H97M Pro 4 motherboard. Looks like a great motherboard so far. Going to go ahead and pull it out of the little plastic sleeve here just to get a look. It's padding on the bottom so I don't have to worry about damaging it. Let's go ahead and pull it out nice and smooth here. Oh my. Got some nice padding on the bottom here. I'm just gonna leave that on there just so we can get a look at it. Okay, as you can see, you got your monitor hookup, your four USB 3.0s, two USB 2.0s, all your sound. This thing looks amazing. Here's your CPU holder right here. I'm not, not exactly sure how to open this exactly. I'm guessing you pull this out and then plop that out. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna go ahead and get that in depth and go ahead and open that up yet. I don't really I don't have a CPU so I'm not even gonna try. So we got all the cable hookups for the front. Um, I believe that let's see front USB 3.0 that's the hookup for the 3.0 so that'll hook up in my case. So everything's labeled which I like. There's your power, um, your SATA cables, it's all labeled very nice. Uh, USB, USB. This is all your USB 2.0s that hook in the front. I only have one USB 3.0 and one USB 2.0 in the front. So, not real complicated in the front. The back is where all the good stuff's going to be at. Intel Gigabyte Ethernet cable. That is great because that is all I run is Ethernet. And one HDMI, and that's all it. Sorry for the interruption there, real quick. So, this motherboard it looks fantastic. It is fantastic. It's got great reviews on it. And coming in at a amazing, 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 amazing 7888. 79, 70, about $80 for this motherboard. A great price for the quality of what you are getting here. So many options. You have um, four RAM slots here. Um, I'm not exactly sure what these are. I don't know if these are other RAM slots. Uh, not real sure, actually. I, I'm not. I'm not real sure. 
I'm not real familiar with all the computer stuff, but I'm kind of coming to you from a level that if you're a beginner, I'm a beginner. I'm going to try to help you guys out. I'm not talking super complicated. I'm trying to help you guys. And uh, these are the parts that I picked out after studying and looking and and just learning as much as I could in such a short amount of time. It took about a month for me to research, and then I, I figured out what I wanted, and I ordered it. Um, the whole parts list is going to be down in the description below. Um, the whole uh, PC parts picker list, everything's down there. Everything that is going to go into this build is down there. Not all the parts are here yet, but I'm also recording this on the 11th. That is when these parts came in. Uh, they estimate between the 13th and the 18th, so any any time now it could be in here. Um, but yeah, this is definitely what I wanted to do next. I haven't opened any of these except for I opened the case because it was in a giant box and it was extremely hard to get out. But once I got it out, then I did a review almost immediately. But this thing is killer. I am really pumped to have this motherboard. It looks fantastic, and I, I bet it's going to perform great. Um, it's, I'm going with the. This is kind of a best bang for your buck PC here. I could, did put a little bit extra into it, um, just so that I can be an extra crazy console slayer killer motherfucker here. I'm only 16, so I don't have a whole buttload of money, but I did have a thousand dollars after I sold my laptop, um, my Xbox couple other things Christmas and birthday money helped out and I only ended up putting about a hundred dollars of my own money into it so that is great that is that is just great hundred dollars out of pocket and I traded my laptop and my Xbox for all these things basically but yep um, go ahead and go a little bit more in depth with what it says on the box just so you guys can get an idea of what it is and I don't have to put it all back but Intel Intel Core compatible has the um, Intel H97 chipset. Seems it's got um, Elna audio caps, Intel Gigabyte uh, Ethernet, Digit Power VRM design. Seems great. Thunderbolt ready. Not exactly sure what that is. Now premium alloy choke. Uh, Next fit MOSFET for memory power. You look, you can see Power Pack versus NextFit. You can see how hot the other one was and how cool this one's going to be. Just looks amazing. Just everything about it is just winning me over. Um, US, USB blocker, PC health center, energy saver. Oh my god, so many things that come with it. Just amazing. It is compatible. It supports... Um, fifth generation Intel Core i7, i5, i3, um, Pentium, Celeron processor supports uh, new fourth and fourth generation Intel Xeon Core i7, i5, i3, uh, Pentium, Celeron processors. Just it supports all the all those processors. Just great. I have the um, i5. I think it's like the 4730. I'm not exactly sure. I can I can take a look at the computer real quick to tell you. Uh, uh, 4690, not 4730. 4690, clocked at uh, 3.5 gigahertz quad core. Should be pretty nasty for doing some really good gaming. So, guys, if you like this video, I'd like to see more. Remember to like, comment, subscribe. Really appreciate it, guys. More videos to come every day at 12 o'clock noon on the dot. So, if you're coming home from school, or anything like that it will be here waiting for you when you get home if not 12 o'clock tune in check out what's going on guys scheduled every day 12 o'clock so guys i really appreciate you clicking on the video thanks for watching see you next time